Now, Chief Meteorologist Brian Davis and your Storm Team 2 forecast. And let's check out that forecast this evening. We're going to see temperatures dropping off through the 40s here. Some rain showers around, especially up through about 8 o'clock. Then we'll get a little bit of a break. Uh, temperatures will be heading into the 30s later on this evening. And then overnight, uh, past midnight, any rain showers that will still be around could change over to some flurries or some light snow showers. Looks like little, if any, accumulation overnight. 8 a.m. 32 and noon temp 38 with cloudy skies. There's a slight chance of a sprinkle or flurry even into the afternoon with 30 nine degrees at 5 p.m. If you're heading over to Columbus as my Boilermakers take on the Buckeyes uh, tailgate there at 1130 about 39 cloudy skies 41 for the kickoff at 330 and uh, getting about half time around 5 to 530 about 39 degrees expected with cloudy skies. There's a slight chance of a couple of sprinkles or flurries during the game, but I don't think it'll be any major amount of precipitation. We're tracking some of those showers tonight uh, across Clinton County and also out in eastern Indiana, Richmond up to Greenville, Sydney, Bell Fountain, uh, seeing some of those rain showers tonight, all swinging eastward as we go through time here. And these showers will be in the form of rain. We don't have to worry about any snow this evening, but farther north and west, you can see some blue beginning to show up in northern Indiana, back out into northern Illinois, and some of those snow showers and flurries will swing across the area later tonight and tomorrow. Maybe a spot or two picks up a light dusting on some of the grass surfaces, maybe a rooftop, but don't think we have to worry about any problems on the roads, especially with temperatures just getting down close to the freezing mark late tonight. And we've uh, just finally now started to get in on some of that colder air. High temperatures Saturday around 40 degrees over most of the Miami Valley. Over the next 10 days, another chilly day on Sunday, also Monday, then a quick warm up Wednesday before we see some more cold air come back after that. Peak wind gusts today, 44, another windy day here around the Miami Valley. 45 Indianapolis, 40 over at Columbus, 40 one at Mansfield for the top wind speeds. Goodwill Auto Auction camera. You can see those clouds rolling in tonight. There's been this little narrow break between two cloud decks. The one southeast of us, another one farther north and west. And uh, that'll gradually fill in here, it looks like, as we go through the next several hours. Currently 47, south-southwest wind at 20 miles per hour. Temperatures tonight dropping off into the mid to upper 40s at all of our locations. Springfield right now 45, Xenia 44 degrees. Our future track forecast, you can see those showers swing through. Then a little break in the action late evening. And then overnight, a few of those snow showers and flurries could uh, drift through the area. And still a slight chance of some sprinkles or flurries tomorrow afternoon. 32 expected for our low tonight. It'll be breezy and colder. We'll see rain showers at first, then a chance of some snow showers or flurries later tonight. And tomorrow, mostly cloudy day, a slight chance of some sprinkles or flurries. A little better chance of some of those flurries in the morning with the colder temperatures to start the day and a high temperature up around 40. Then on uh, Saturday night into early Sunday morning, late Saturday night, uh, some snow could start to move in from the northwest. We may have some of that around early Sunday. That'll go over to some rain showers during the day. Back over to some snow showers Sunday night and early Monday. Again, there could be some small accumulations. We'll watch for that potential. You want to stay tuned to the latest forecast for uh, Saturday evening. Carly will have that for you. And then uh, Tuesday, 54 for the high. A uh, morning low of 28 after those chances of morning flurries Monday. Wednesday, we'll see a chance of late day rain, but warming up quickly into the 60s, but then cooling off on Thursday. Some early day showers and a high only around 50 on Friday. Brooke.